Hi there, Bitcoin is pumping. In this video, I'm going to talk about why Bitcoin is pumping. It will not have escaped your attention that Bitcoin is up. The whole crypto market is up. We're still in the bear market, which means down. So I'm going to talk about exactly why that uh, why that is in this video. If you're new here, my name is Mike Pitt. I make videos about business and crypto so you can grow your business, increase your profits and increase your portfolio. Before I get into the main content of the video, I'm going to put my socials on screen there. So if you you like what you see, you're happy and you want to subscribe and follow, please connect with me on those socials and I will uh, reciprocate, follow you back, etc. OK, why is Bitcoin pumping? I'm going to put a screenshot of CoinMarketCap. You can see that Bitcoin has gone up in the last few days from 16,000 to 20, 21,000. I'll put the exact price at the time of editing. Uh, so it's gone up quite a lot. Uh, this has been followed by all of the others. Bitcoin takes a lead. As you know, Bitcoin takes a lead in the crypto market. So the total, total market cap uh, has gone up for the crypto market. I'll put that figure on screen as well. And all of the other cryptos, with very few exceptions in the top 50, have gone up and are showing green on coin market cap. Why is this? This is not because of any fundamental changes in macroeconomic conditions. We've talked about the Ukraine-Russia war. We've talked about high inflation rates in lots of key markets, the US and the UK being two of those. Uh, but it's because lots of institutional investors have been shorting Bitcoin. And in layman's terms, that means they've been betting on the price of Bitcoin going down. And it's actually gone up. So they've had to close those positions. Institutional investors have had to buy Bitcoin to uh, or to mitigate their losses when sh in shorting Bitcoin. And it's gone up as a consequence, it's gone up. Also, some positive economic news in the US, the inflation rate has gone down to 6.5%. And whenever the inflation is down, or it's a, it's a positive sign for the markets and the crypto market being like the stock market starts to rally uh, in, in some senses when uh, there is a positive economic news. So those are the reasons why Bitcoin is pumping. Is Does this pumping of Bitcoin from 16,000 to uh, 21,000, does that mean the end of the bear market? No, it doesn't. This is a, a sort of temporary phase and may go on for a number of weeks, but it's not... We've not yet reached the end of the bear market. The end of the bear, the end of the bear market is predicted, and it's something I believe in. And it's predicted to end at the end of 2023. So 2024 will be the return to the bull market when you you should typically see, uh, if four-year cycles are repeated, you should typically see Bitcoin going from uh, its uh, its relative low at the moment, the relative low, let's say, of a couple of weeks ago, 16, 15, uh, to up to. 70 maybe 80 90 thousand uh in the in, in 2024 that's all ahead of us and we obviously we'll watch the markets but i thought i'd better do a quick reaction because obviously bitcoin is up the crypto markets are up and people are thinking well where did that come from and it's not it's not just that uh, inflation in the us was now 6.5 percent it's not just that it's also the fact that uh, lots of institutional investors have had to have had who have been shorting bitcoin have had to um buy bitcoin and close their short positions. I hope this short video has been useful to you. I try and be reactive to what's going on in market as well. I will continue to do longer videos, as you know. Uh, keep watching, keep subscribing. I appreciate it. If this video has been useful to you, thanks for watching. Please give me a like. Please click on one of the two thumbnails to watch another video from me. I look forward to speaking to you next time. Until the next time, peace.